Some claim that Islam gave mathematics to the world, but what if history tells a different story? The Bakshali manuscript carbon dated to the 3rd century CE is an ancient Hindu text on arithmetic and algebra. It covers simultaneous equations, quadratic equations, geometric progressions, and the earliest recorded use of zero. Algebraic concepts are even older found in the Shulba Sutras dating back to 800 BCE. Later, Aryabhata from the 5th century CE and Bhaskara in the 12th century CE expanded these principles. The term algebra comes from Al-Khwarizmi's 9th century book Al-Kitab Al-Jabra wal Mukabla, but historical evidence shows that before writing it, he studied Indian mathematics. British historian Henry Thomas Colebrook and Italian mathematician Pietro Cusali both concluded that Khwarizmi derived his algebra from Indian sources, not Greek or Arabic works. Another 9th century Arab mathematician Al-Kindi wrote the book Kitab Fi Istimal Al-Adad Al-Hindiya or on the use of Hindu numerals. Until the late 8th century, nearly 140 years after Islam's emergence, no Arabic work on science, mathematics or medicine existed. The Arabs gained access to advanced sciences only after encountering scholars and texts in the territories that they conquered. Algebra, like many other fields of knowledge, was not an Arabic invention. It was an Indian legacy. The evidence is undeniable. India was far ahead in mathematics and algebra was ours long before the world gave it a name.